So here's a look at our starting point, the McRae campus. This is really the home of skilled trades at uh, Fleming. It's about 45,000 square feet and a really outdated facility. We've added in some temporary space at our main campus and we've also leased facilities as well. But now's our opportunity. I'm standing in front of the construction site right now. Uh, we'll be doubling the space, doubling the number of students, introducing real state-of-the-art facilities that will give students a chance to really learn the skills that they need for tomorrow. This is a $35 million project, but uh, we do not have all of the funding in place, and uh, in order to have all of the equipment that we need, uh, we're undertaking another initiative, uh, which is uh, the $1 million campaign to raise funds to uh, complete this project effectively. I'm the no-collar. He's a suit and tie guy. I'm the blue-collar. I represent the, the construction end of this campaign, uh, which is uh, very exciting. Yeah. I'm the uh, co-chair responsible for manufacturing in Peterborough, Kawartha Lakes, and Northumberland region, and uh, we have a great team. Uh, well, probably close to 100 people are involved on the campaign uh, in various sectors. Uh, we have a campaign cabinet. Uh, we're looking to raise about a million dollars over the next year. The Kawartha Skilled Trade Centre will provide tremendous opportunities for our students. We're very confident of that. Really what I see the Kawartha Skilled Trade Centre providing is an opportunity for all of our students. We have many students who go on to various destinations at post-secondary, so this really gives them an opportunity right at their doorstep to visit, perhaps at the early grades of high school even, and then later on consider it as a post-secondary destination. It's a great chance for students who perhaps are more inclined to look at the trades, work with their hands, like to create and build things, or work with machinery. Students who may be not overly inclined towards working with uh, books and lectures and being talked to, but rather work at and be practical. And we all know it's a tremendous opportunity of growth for a job sector. And, and frankly, our parents are coming on board and realize that these provide great career opportunities for our students to have uh, good life chances beyond high school. The uh, KTTC Centre, well, uh, we see that as a, as a big benefit for us. Um, there's been a bit of a, a void over, the, I'd say, the last 10 or 15 years in the area for skilled tradespeople. So the center being here in Peterborough will be a big boon. Uh, you know, I think uh, you get the tradespeople uh, coming out of those facilities. Those tradespeople tend to work for somebody for a while, but uh, quite often they're the new entrepreneurs. It's the electricians, the, uh, the millwrights, the toolmakers that start their own businesses. And... Uh, and so I see that as a huge boon for our local economy uh, going forward. Uh, KTTC is very important to the Peterborough region uh, because of the, uh, the training facility that they're putting together um, and the amount of students that are coming into our area and learning new trades in every facet of the construction industry from heating to mechanicals to plumbing to carpentry, electrical, many different uh, facets and phases of the construction industry. So it's very important for us to have these kids, uh, male and female, coming to the college, learning these trades so that when uh, they graduate, they're ready to move into opportunities with uh, the local contractors, whether it be residential, renovation, or even in the commercial industry. We need to develop a skilled workforce, and hopefully um, having this facility here, it gives great opportunity for uh, individuals looking to get into the skilled trades, uh, a great uh, learning facility and uh, ultimately, uh, hopefully it will bring good jobs back to our community. My interest here is, is the fact that we're going to build a trade centre in Peterborough that's going to draw people here, that's going to keep people here, hopefully build the industry, uh, make opportunity for people to, to expand on their skills and to, and to uh, give their children some place to stay and work here, hopefully. I think it's great that the money that we're raising, you know, we're going to be able to see where that's going. We're going to go and see the tools and be put in the labs and we're working hard to, to raise that money. I think that's fantastic.